What's up guys, how's it going? My name is Lars, and welcome back to another Kingdom Hearts Kingdom Cross video. So, we're gonna be talking about the monthly update that we got today, because it is June 1st, 2019 over there in Japan. So, let's go ahead and jump into it guys, and of course a big shout out to Robolore and to Ryuji for uh, letting me use uh, their translations in my update video. So, thank you so much guys for your hard, hard work. So, uh, first things first guys is going to be related to uh, a bug that's been going around in the game uh, The bugs listed in the previous bug log which was talking about the reflect problems like the whole reflectability thing uh, Will be fixed in a mid-June to early July update. Uh, I don't know exactly what that bug was Because uh, I haven't really been paying too much attention uh, too much attention to uh, Union cars, but uh, uh, whatever bug it is, it is going to be taken care of, so make sure to see uh, for a future update where that's going to be fixed. Uh, next thing that we're going to be talking about is uh, just, you know, the daily raid boss for the week as right there. It is the dark side, so, and of course that will go away on June the 9th. So that's it for that. Uh, next thing we're going to be talking about is uh, traits, trait boards to be exact. So, get trait medals from these avatar boards or trait boards, whatever you want to call them. Uh, they feature, each of them costs uh, 1,500 jewels per board, three trait medals of the medals that I will list here in just a second, uh, three SP Chippendale medals, and an SP gauge to attack boost, let me make sure if I'm saying this correctly, attack boost 7 max. Uh, thank you to Ryuji for that, because <laughs> apparently I can't do Roman. So, uh, yeah, so attack boost 7, uh, SP gauge 2 max. Uh, so the trait medals for these boards are Super Burst Kingdom Hearts 3 Sora, Super Burst Kingdom Hearts 3 Riku, Super Burst Kingdom Hearts 3 Young Xehanort, Kingdom Hearts 3 Vanitas, I'm not gonna say Super Burst anymore, uh, Kingdom Hearts 3 Anti-Aqua, Kingdom Hearts 3 Boy in White, Kingdom Hearts 3 Boy in Black. You can unlock these boards up to five times, so yeah, that's a lot of trait medals if you're trying to go for like the perfect traded medal, so... That is it for that. Uh, those boards, they do go away on June the 19th. So you have roughly almost three weeks to actually pick them up if you choose so. Uh, next thing we're going to be talking about, guys, is a uh, banner that uh, it's kind of like those like daily banners that they want to throw out there for you guys. Uh, so with these uh, Super Burst upgradable banners, uh, this is a one day banner. You can pull at most once per day. You can get one tier eight or tier nine super burst upgradable metal per pull, uh, one tier nine dual meow per pull, and ten limited time VIP coins per pull. Honestly, guys, easy skip. Don't pull on this. This is just kind of like there to throw it in there uh, to make this screen right here just like more and more full. So easy skip, guys. Don't don't pull on it. It's honestly just a waste of jewels uh, for anybody in general. So. Uh, next thing we're going to be talking about is the brand new metal itself, which is Superverse Kingdom Hearts 3 Roxas, guys. This metal is very interesting. So, get Superverse Kingdom Hearts 3 Roxas from this new banner. He has 30,000 max strength. I believe that's the highest we have so far as a metal with that much strength. Uh, correct me if I'm wrong in the comment section below. Uh, so, the normal banner features two Kingdom Hearts 3 medals per pull, one Superverse upgradable medal in 10 pulls, and 10 limited time VIP coins per pull. The premium banner features four Kingdom Hearts 3 medals per pull, one Super Burst Kingdom Hearts 3 Roxas in 10 pulls, so it is a 10 Mercy pull, not a 5 Mercy pull, which I think is stupid. Um, and then 10 limited time VIP coins per pull. So, what does he do? This medal is pretty insane. He is a tier 9 medal, upright power, 3 gauges, multiplier is at 47.27, to 55.13. He is an AoE medal, so that is a very strong multiplier for an AoE medal. Damage increases with a higher slot number, 15% chance to ignore enemy defensive skills. So Monster Sora, Zeus, you know, etc. etc. Reflex 15% of power type damage taken. So basically, two mechanics, two crazy mechanics in one freaking medal and you know, to kind of keep it a little bit balanced, they lower the chances of it for any of these two abilities to actually kick in with this metal. Because if it was at the normal 30%, then that metal would just be, or this metal would be insanely broken. So that's why they, or I'm assuming that's why they lowered the percentage of any of these two abilities within this brand new Roxas metal uh, to 15%. But still though, that is 
insane for a metal. This is, this is a metal that is almost like a must at this point for PvP. Um, the only thing I have about this banner though is again, for VIP players, it is a 10 mercy pool. For free to play players, honestly, you'll be lucky to even get this medal, except for the pack for the fact you that you get one super bus upgradable medal in 10 pulls, so it could be anything at this point. <clears throat> so uh, it does five hits. The super bus ability, the multiply starts off at 170, 210 on upgrade. It's an AoE attack, and for one turn, debuffs the enemies upright. Power defense by 10 tiers, raises the kill to four medals by 200 or 200 once you upgrade it to Super Burst Plus, and in PvP, this ability activates on slot 3. So again, this meta right here is strictly for PvP, guys. So, I mean, you guys already know when it comes to the traits, of course, get those plus 1000s, get the grounds if you want to. Um, but this metal right here i mean no i can't i can't really say it's strictly for pvp because i mean it does reflect 15 percent of power type uh attacks uh right back to the enemy so this is an overall metal in between um pvp and just like if you know future events maybe high score challenges uh coliseum you know etc etc so um Overall, though, it is a very strong metal. Um, it's a metal that, you know, if you haven't gotten anti-aqua, if you haven't gotten any of the uh, the metals that uh, breaks through the enemy's defensive skills and, he, and you've been considering uh, waiting on a very strong metal that's actually worth it, this one right here could be a very, very good metal to actually pull for if you have the 30k jewels and you're ready for that 10 mercy. Unless you somehow manage to get it beforehand, then... You know gg to you but in general though if any like free to play player is wanting to chase this matter honestly it would not be worth it only because there's no mercy pull for it that's the only issue i have against it but of course do remember that all kingdom Hearts 3 meadows they do come back uh in future banners you know we will see them again you do have a chance of pulling them in the future so it's nothing to be too too concerned about but especially if you already have like anti-aqua you have Zeus, Masasaur, and you're doing okay in PvP. You're getting uh, a, a good enough ranking to your, uh, to your, I guess, needs. Um, then I would say, you know, just wait on it. See if you can get lucky in the future and uh, do actually manage to pull him. So, uh, but overall, though, Roxas is a very strong metal. Uh, I, I'm not gonna say he's broken because uh, if the percentage was 30%, then it would definitely be broken. So I am kind of happy that they lowered the percentage down to 15, but still, it's a very strong metal. So uh, we're gonna uh, end it off with that. Uh, the banner, they do go away on June 17th. So you have about two weeks to uh, pick it up, a little over two weeks, actually. Uh, next thing we're gonna be talking about, guys, is a free draw for the month of June, which is pretty awesome. So. Celebrate 10 million downloads with these free pulls throughout the month of June. The normal banner features all pulls are free, you can pull at most once per day, and you do get one tier 9 dual meow wow in 5 pulls, which is nice. The premium banner, which of course you gotta, you gotta uh, buy VIP, all pulls are free, uh, you can pull at most once per day, and uh, it's basically the same thing, <laughs> one tier 9 dual meow wow in five pulls so that is pretty awesome i will be doing my free pull at the end of this video uh so make sure to uh yeah make sure to watch those pulls at the end uh i believe that it is a single draw it's not a it's not a uh, multi-pull so uh but i guess we'll confirm that here in just a bit uh next thing with today's monthly update is going to be an sp boost for this month in login rewards so get sp boost in june in login rewards Medals can get plus 200% guilt boost this month. The medals that will benefit from this SP boost, SP boost are Super Burst Kingdom Hearts 3 Roxas medal, as well as reprinted medals which will appear, appear in VIP, which take uh, take example, the new, well not really new, but the, um, the Aqua medal that recently got its upgrade and is now a tier 9 medal. That's going to be in this week's uh, VI, uh, upcoming uh, VIP. So uh, that will also benefit from this plus 200% uh, percent guild uh, boost for this month as well. Um, so uh, that is it for that. That'll be for the entire month right there. So you should be seeing this uh, every, if I'm, if I'm correct, uh, you should be seeing this boost pretty much every day to, uh, to get that extra uh, guilt percentage to, your, uh, to those medals. Um, next thing we're going to be talking about is Colosseum with this weird... I don't even know what to say about this. <laughs> that threw me off so bad. So, uh, 
get the skill Lux Attack Boost 10 Max, if I'm not mistaken. Let me double check the notes, because uh, I do not want to give you guys any false information. Uh, where you at? Where you at? Where you at? Da, 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 da. Yes, okay. So this month's Coliseum skill is Lux Attack Boost 10 Max. 10. 10 people. 10. <laughs> so yeah, pretty crazy, huh? Um, and the Fungus Glasses for Monsters Inc. in June's Coliseum. The Fungus Glasses boost the rare enemy encounter rates by plus two. So you guys already know, do your Coliseum, get the free avatar point, <laughs> and uh, so on and so forth. And good luck to everybody with uh, their Coliseum rankings. Um, next thing is going to be this month's pet. Get the Alpha Caster pet points and the Princess or Pet Princess Tiara in this month's Lux tax. You guys already know the deal. 10 billion Lux and you get, <clears throat> you pretty much get everything that you see here on the screen. Uh, next thing with uh, this VIP is of course the monthly gem quest. You see the keyblades right there, etc, etc, and so on and so forth. <laughs> and the final thing guys for this, uh, for this update video is going to be an, an event. Battle some new Heartless to get a title, a Power Gem, and Chips and Dales. So, you guys already know the deal with these type of events. They have a lot of HP. So, uh, don't count on it being uh, no little to no HP. So, this event does go away on June the 10th, guys. So, let's go ahead and do my free pulls. Uh, one thing that I do want to note is that I do have 1500 jewels. You guys already know, Roxas is my favorite character. So, I will be doing a short live stream later today of me pulling and hoping that I can get Roxas in five pulls. So, uh, and you guys already know my ONG in this game has just been utter crap. <laughs> so, let's just hope that I do manage to get it, guys. So, make sure that you are following my Twitch channel. The link will be down in the description below for you guys. It is free to make an account. That is where I have been live streaming for like the past, what, months? Two, two, three months now. So, make sure you're following me on there. I don't only stream cucks from here and there, but I do... Uh, stream other mobile games like the City Opera Omnia, uh, what, do you, what do you call it, Dragon Ball Z, Dokkan Battle, and you know, so on, so on and so forth. So uh, make sure to follow me on there for live streams for me. So let's go ahead and do my free pool. Uh, I don't know which is what, so I'm going to assume this is the free one, and I guess we'll see. Uh, so it, this is nice though. I mean, basically for free to play players, 30 free draws for everybody and then for uh, VIP players it's 60 draws so I like that so uh yeah lovely start <laughs> so uh we get the uh, the hooded guy I forgot his name I, I actually, actually I don't even think he has a name so let's do this one and then we'll go ahead and end it off so thank you so much for watching guys uh uh if you enjoyed it make sure to smash that like button and subscribe for some future Union Cross content and we get a freaking Fantasia B or whatever, Mickey B, whatever the nanny you call it. Anyway, so thanks so much for watching, guys. Take care and hope to see you guys later today for my potential trash pool. <laughs> Take care, guys.